Yo, what is up beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video and today I actually have a lot of things planned in regards to Cabal's Lowlands. So today's gonna be some of the final preparations um, before the Cabal's Lowlands and then we're gonna go back to do some Slayer. But first things first, I started at 85 Thieving and I'm almost 88. Um, I'm gonna get 88 so I can then plus 3 boost to 91 and then finish Achievement Diaries. If you're unfamiliar with what I try to do right now, is I basically try to complete all the Achievement Diaries and my Quest Cape before I actually, uh, before Cabo's Lowlands come out. So I have about, um, what, about seven days to get everything done and I am pretty sure I'll be able to do it. Um, so we're talking all of the Achievement Diaries uh, to complete and then um, basically all the quest uh, quests to complete as well. Those are the goals. First things first, let's get this 88 thieving very quickly. And I missed it. No. Oh well, we got 88 uh, thieving. This man said, "Grats, I'm gonna say th I'm gonna say thanks." Fuck, I can't type. Thank. All right. Um, anyways, I need to go to sleep as you can probably tell. I just wanted to get this out of the way, and we got 934,000 in the process. So not bad at all. I think next things that I have to do are probably gonna be quests when I wake up or. Um, this Lova Kenji or Shazian uh, freaking percentages. I still have to get that. So I'll see what I end up doing. Maybe the current quest first. I have to get 20% in Shazian in order to start my first quest. There we go. We are now at 5%. Let's kill some lizard man. Should be very quick. I'll take a cannon and I'll take some uh, range gear. There we go. We now have 20% and we can now complete the quest. I'll focus on completing all the 100% after the quest because I think you got some bonuses. Maybe not. I'm not exactly sure. Here we go. Pretty easy quest. Soon to be done. And I believe I get like 10% chasing in favor for it. I need to get quest cape anyway, so that was pretty useful to do. And there we go, 10% chasing in favor. What do I do? I I'm gonna look it up what I have to do for the fastest methods of obtaining my slayer, I mean my chasing in favor. Um, so let's see what we have to do. 40%, let's find some organized crimes. I'm quickly gonna go to the bank first though. First off, speak to Captain Guinea and uh, I guess you just ask her about stuff. So can I help? Uh, do you know any meetings? Let's see. And you can always check this information right here. The next one starts in four minutes. I'll check where this place is. There we go. Place my cannon and here is the first gang. So if I'm not mistaken, I should be able, if I speed through this, uh, get 100% basically instantly. All those intelligences is what we want to pick up. Also, we're going to be picking up the cannons, I mean the composts. Cannon definitely helping out big time here, so that's going to be, let's see, how much was that? Oh, that was quite a lot of percentages, we're going to take this, this, intelligence, pick up, hop. Let's see if we can find the, I'll just hop the world. It's very early in the morning right now, so it should be everywhere I fuck. Am I getting trolled? Is there like no other words going right now? Are you kidding me? I'm actually sad. I thought there were multiple worlds happening at the same time, but I guess I was wrong. Or I was just unfortunate that my world was the last world to be on. Dude, that fucking sucks. Wait, maybe I need to try the UK world. Hold up. Fuck's sake. Alright, how much XP do you actually get for these things? So I can get XP in... Eh. Alright, just like combat stats and about 2.k, 2k for each, so let's just get strength, I guess, why not. Let's see where is the next uh, gank thing meeting. 14 minutes, yeah, I'm going to bed, fuck this. A lot of more people this time around, it feels. They probably fix this. Yeah, there's just one world. Oh, never mind. So why couldn't I find the world earlier? I'm so confused. Alright, this time it worked, we just hopped the world and there you go. Another gang. And I'm on 100%. That is awesome. I'll just finish this gang right here and uh, then we're done. Alright, now all I have left is Lova Kenji. And I will actually do that before I do any other things. Before I do Slayer or whatever I end up doing. And that is mainly just going to be mining sulfur. And it may take a while, unfortunately. But oh well. Alright, that was pretty quick. Let's claim some uh, intelligence right there. And we're now going to go... I'll just put everything on strength. I don't really 
have a use of that. This might be a decent XP for like some unique accounts, I guess. Uh, either way, before we do anything, I want to lock my favor in. And I can do that by speaking to a person in this tent right over here. Oh, this is so annoying, this thing zooming in and out. But basically speak to this. And that should be it. And now all I have is Lovacange and I think it just mine stuff. So some people have been wondering about my Iron Man. So this is one of the first few levels, 91 room crafting. Uh, and I'm currently working on 99 room crafting and 99 mining. I'm kind of burnt from my um, from this account at the moment. Therefore, I'm just focusing on my main, but I'm still playing this and I'm just like doing the AFK stuff on it. And if I can somehow push myself to finish 99 room crafting, that is going to be one of the hardest 99s to get out of the way. And uh, I'm actually pretty motivated to get it off the way as well. So uh, I'm doing soul runes, uh, which is probably not ideal. Um, I made the uh, almost 3 mil from 90 to 91. Uh, but basically, uh, blood runes would in long term probably be better. Uh, but for me personally, getting that more XP is just better. If I need money, I can always go kill some Necreals or whatever, and then just use that money to buy the Blood Runes. However, this is not my Iron Man episode. Let's jump back on the main. This one actually took me longer than I would like to admit, but as you can see in the chat box, I just need to speak to the guy in um, Lova Kanji area and I have 100% everywhere, which is awesome. I'm pretty sure you speak to him right over here. I'm also going to favor overlay, turn that off and we speak to Lovada. Have a little bit of talk and I should be able to teleport to the middle right now or I have to go there first. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, but this is one of the things I need to complete for the current diaries when they come out. Let's see if I can teleport to heart. Uh, and I cannot. So I basically have to go to the middle and speak with all the architects first. And okay, so I just spoke to one of the architects and that should complete this mini quest. And I should then be able to teleport here. Which is going to be one of the elite diaries in the current diary. Uh, so that's going to be pretty awesome. Let's get this statue done. Alright, I think that should be it. I can now teleport to fuck. To heart, please. Nice, awesome, there you go. Uh, that's really good. Uh, and I think I will start g completing the quest right now. Five quests to do, all of them really annoying. Now let's go fight, don't know what. But just keep on moving. Be sure to watch out from those slow... Boss fight is done. We will already commence boss fight number two, so be sure to be prepared. My voice has been getting progressively worse throughout the video. I'm uh, catching a cold, unfortunately, but either way, the quest should be completed. And now we have four left. So four of the most annoying quests in the game. I, for some reason, left them all the way until the end. There we go, finally. All right, got some experience that I don't really need. Uh, what should I start with Morning's Ends or with Rag and Bone Man? I'm not sure. Probably Rag and Bone Man and leave Morning's End, the worst quest, all the way until the end. So yeah, let's do it. Alright, any moment now. I see why people despise this quest. This is just the first part. The second part takes even longer to do. Like, this one takes like 10 minutes. The second part takes like over an hour. Um, but anyways, that's the part number one. Let's start part number two. Well, this quest is pretty shit, but at least hopefully I have everything done right now. And I do, which is awesome, so I'm gonna take the bone sack, and uh, there we go. That quest is really annoying, actually, but that is now out of the way. And I guess I'll just move on straight to Morning's End. Uh, those are the two quests that I always hate doing, but at least it's gonna be easier to do on a main account than on an Iron Man. So, let's go ahead, crack those down, and then complete some diaries. The quest is about to be done, which is awesome. And now we're gonna have the most annoying quest for the last quest on the account. So it's currently 2 a.m. I'm gonna just push through this, I guess. Uh, decent quest rewards, like 25k thieving and HP. And here it is, boys and girls, just this one left. In case you guys never knew about this, once you reach this part of the quest, some people get stuck by not rotating the mirror, meaning that they have to do the entirety of the light puzzle again. 
But a small thing that very little people know is there is this tunnel behind the, the dwarf and that puts you right into the underground pass as you can see and you can enter this thing and come back here so if you were to at some point on your Iron Man fuck up the pillar of light here and you forgot to rotate it back to the staircase so you can re-enter this is your second option how to reach this dwarf. And now that we are finally done with all the quests, my throat is absolutely killing me. Um, but there it is, man, Morning's End Part 2, in my opinion, the most annoying quest. But with the help of Slayer Music 1, that was honestly not that bad at all. So I always watch his guides. If you guys want to do this quest, he does a perfect guide on it. So go ahead and give it a watch and finish this quest. It's, it's worth it. Uh, we're gonna get ourselves a quest cape now and then we have a bunch of diaries to complete. Alright, and this is why we have been doing all these quests to get ourselves a escape and the diary. So the diary would be to just do this as far as I know and then we should be good. And I have to do this on a couple of other places, I think, I'm not 100% sure. But there it is, man. Boom, elite task in Lumbridge and Drainer area. Now that I have all of those quests completed, I'm also going to use uh, Mr. Wise Old Man right here um, to do, wait, this guy's doing a thingy, to check items for junk. And there you have it, all of this is apparently junk. Uh, and I'm not exactly sure, but I'm just gonna believe it. So I'm just gonna start removing stuff uh, because, yeah, why not? Like, all of this is just gonna get removed. If I do a mistake, let me know in the comments if there is something I should not be removing out here. Uh, cat speed, amulet gone, monkey speed gone, armadil pendant, boom and boom. And now I have a little bit of more space in my bank. However, let's start with, um, I want to complete all the Lumbridge and Drainer achievement diaries first. Boom. Um, for some reason, past me planted that, so that saves me five hours. Awesome. Boom. 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 And boom. Don't mind me just waiting for a train. And boom. That's gonna be hard, diaries. Let's complete elites. I hate my life. Had to come here to buy this. Yay. Boom. This is actually a very decent thieving experience, if you were wondering. Boom, there we go. Hey, there we go. And now elites are also completed. Let's claim the rewards. Look at this guy, Mr. Hideous Kosai. What the fuck is that name? All right, give me both of my rewards. Thank you. And now I finally have Explorer Ring 4, meaning that I can use it, for example, on Necreal tasks. And also, I'm never gonna need Draymond's staffs anymore because I can now teleport using Fairy Ring without the Draymond Staff, so really, really helpful. We are going to be claiming all of these rewards, I think, on Mining Experience, because Rune Crafting, I... Uh, yeah, I think Mining. I think Mining is going to be the most annoying to train on this account particularly, uh, so a lot of experience there, really, really nice. Alright, with the lead diaries out of the way, I'm now going to conclude the episode. So hopefully you guys did enjoy watching it, and if you did, make sure to give the video a rating. Also, if you're not yet subscribed, feel free to do so. Uh, I am mainly uploading all sorts of RuneScape videos. So with that being said, really hopefully you enjoyed. I'll see you again, most likely, tomorrow. Bye-bye.